Is anyone there? Uh, hi. What's going on guys? It's your boy Ultimate DS Man and this is so weird because uh I'm going on a Sonic merch hunt adventure just like the Toys R Us video. I don't show my face in front of camera a lot, so this is really awkward. Um But yeah, hope you all enjoy. Uh today we're gonna be going to a Target and it is hang on an hour and 30 minutes away. And um I'm gonna maybe record myself like this so yeah uh we're gonna be going to a target today and it's gonna be in the style of a stupid vlog thing um i've never really done anything like this before i have done a merch uh i've have i have done merch videos in the past but um this one's gonna have a different um style to it so let's see how this goes um but yeah we're gonna try to find those bendy sonic figures if we can and uh, maybe some other Sonic stuff, I don't know. Or maybe even go to a mall later on, I don't know. But uh, yeah, let's just see what happens. Let's go, gamers. All right, guys, we are making our way to the target. And some hopes I have, I really hope we find some of those Bendy figures, because um, those look amazing. Uh, they're new figures by Jack Specific, since uh, Tomy doesn't have the license anymore to the Sonic, uh, to make Sonic toys and whatnot. So I really hope we find some of those Jack uh, Specific, Pacific figures, sorry. And uh, I'm really hoping we might even find those uh, Morph Ball ones, like the Mighty and Ray figures. Cause yeah, Mighty and Ray have like official merch now. It's fucking amazing. Um, so I really hope we find a Mighty. I don't know, like, um, I don't know what they're gonna have. I don't know if I've even been to this Target or what. But uh, yeah, Target is a good place to find Sonic the Hedgehog merch since we can't really go to Toys R Us anymore. So yeah, and uh, since the Toys R Us video, um, people seem to like it. So I really wanted to do a merch hunt another one of these merch hunt videos because they're really fun to make too i have a lot of fun making them but uh this uh this one's gonna be kind of different in the fact that i'm gonna be also recording myself so you get to see what i look like and whatnot even though i don't show my face uh in front of the camera that much uh hardly ever um yeah i don't know but yeah hopefully uh hopefully we'll find some santa hedgehog trademark merchandise Alright guys, we have made it to the target as you can see and uh, I'm really fucking nervous because I, I don't 
I don't film in public like this. I've never done anything like this before. So uh, I'm extremely nervous. Um, <laughs> oh my god, so many people are going to look at me. Okay. <laughs> Yay, shouts to having social anxiety. But let's go. Okay. I'm an epic vlogger, YouTube man now. Okay. Hang on, let me, uh, I haven't driven the city in a long ass time, so it uh, was kind of rough, but we're doing it. We're doing it. This is so weird. Oh my god, so many people are gonna look at me. I love social anxiety. Oh my god, this is so weird. What am I doing? Okay, we're good. Oh my god, so hopefully we'll find some cool uh, Sonic stuff because that's what we're here for, so. I'm gonna make you guys happy with some content, some quality content. So, uh, yeah, don't mind me, everyone. I'm just an epic YouTube man. <laughs> oh my god. It's been so long since I've been in the city. Shit's crazy. So, I don't know if they're gonna kick me out or what. I don't know if they have like a camera policy or what. Alright, you guys. This is the exit. Let's go this way. Alright. So I think it should be somewhere. Oh no. I think I've been here before. I don't know. Ooh. They got snake up there. Let's see. Your Fallout beanie. Shouts to Fallout 76 being the worst thing ever. Oh, there's the game. It's everyone's favorite game. Fallout 76. The best game ever made. Oh, they got Crash Bandicoot up there. Don't know if you see that. There we go. Got Alien. Got Pokemon. Nothing I'm. They got Yu Gi Oh! That's pretty cool. What the fuck? You see that down there? Oh my god. Why is that a thing? I see Kirby up there. Uh, excuse me, do you work here? Yeah. Um, do you guys have any, like, Sonic the Hedgehog merchandise or anything? No. Really? This is okay. Pretty much all we have right here. Okay. Um, I'm not sure if we have more stuff towards toys. Like, yeah. That's more like stuffed animals. Yeah, all right, I could check over there. Thank you, though. No problem. Well, that didn't work. Sad gamer hours. Anything over here I want? No, we did get a snake amiibo. But nothing too interesting. Shoot. We could try a mall or something. Ooh. No, I don't need any of this stuff. It's Halloween. Bones. Alright, we need to find... Oh, I don't know where it would be, though. Hmm. We'll go exploring, I guess. Oh my god. We found it. There it is. We found the goods. Jackpot. We got a soda Plus they got, they got knuckles and tails. Let's see, we can uh, let's go ahead and pick up Sonic. Uh, let's see, we can get all of them. <laughs> let's steal all of these. They got Pikachu, very soft. They got another one down there. They got Mario. Creeper, oh man, they don't have any creepers. Pretty funny though. Haha, <laughs> funny meme. Yeah, cuphead figures? When did this happen? Nothing else over here. I guess we'll go ahead and take all of these. Uh, we'll just get like two. I guess Sonic and Tails. Put you back, Knuckles. Save you for someone else. Alright, let's get out of here. Oh, this is awkward. Okay. <laughs> Alright. That's all they had. Got one knuckles left. 
All right, they don't have the Mighty Array ones though, but that's okay. Halloween. The bones. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. I'm surprised no one said anything, but I guess they're cool with it. I've seen uh, that Supersonic guy, what's his name? He's made a lot of um, merch hunting videos as well. Um, that Supersonic guy has made a lot of merch hunting videos as well. His videos are really good. I forget his name though. Hmm. You guys probably know who I'm talking about. Whew. We are out now and we got the goods. They had the Bendy Sonic figures. Uh, they didn't have Mighty or Ray, unfortunately, but uh, it's fine. Um, I kind of want to go somewhere else too, maybe like in the mall or something. It's been really fun. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> this has been pretty fun so far. But, uh, yeah, this is really weird. I've never done anything like this before. Like, I've made merching hunting videos in the past, but not with, like, not in this style. So, yeah, it's very uh, different and weird. I'm trying something new, guys. But, yeah, I like build up confidence showing myself in front of a camera because I never do that. But, uh, yeah, pretty cool shit. I'm gonna cut through here. I don't know if we're gonna go to a mall next or what. I don't even know if there's any malls around here. There probably would be, considering how big this place is, but I don't know. So, we'll just, uh, I don't know. We'll figure something out. But we got a Snake Amiibo and the Sonic and Tails figure. All right, guys, we are back in my car now, and we got oh, the Sonic, Jack Specific, Sonic, Benny, Mini figure thingy, yeah, let's turn it down, and uh, he looks really good, <laughs> like, I've heard really good things about this thing, and uh, he looks amazing, like, look at that sculpt, hang on, look at that sculpt, he looks fantastic, and he comes with this little knuckles, sprite, spinny thingy, I don't, it looks kind of neat, but I, I just got for the figure, these things are only $10, like, that's pretty good, like, look at the freaking detail, and the paint, Everything looks so good on him. And he's only 10 bucks. Like, come on now. Of course I had to get two. Now, I didn't want to completely break bank and uh, get three of them. But, uh, yeah, we got Tails here. And uh, he comes with the Amy Spinner. Looks pretty cool. He's like, he looks a lot like the Jazzwares uh, Tails Superposer. If you remember how great that figure was. So, yeah, because the Tommy Tails figure uh, with the Sonic Forces bundle... That thing sucked. <laughs> that thing was awful, dude. But uh, this Tails looks freaking cool and clean as fuck, dude. Oh my god. And this packaging is really good, too. Like, I really dig this packaging. And that render of Sonic, too. Here's the back, by the way. Really cool shit, man. It's just unfortunate they didn't have any of the, the Morph Ball ones, like Mighty and Ray. And we got a Sneak Amiibo. I'm not super into Amiibo anymore, but, like... I just had to get the snake one, man, because it's fucking snake as an amiibo. Like, that is amazing. Um, I can't wait for the banjo one, too. That's going to be amazing. And the Terry one now. And maybe Gino in the future or Rayman. Mm. I don't know. Uh, I can't believe there are any more characters. Like, what the fuck? But anyway, this Sonic looks amazing. Here's another look at him. Just absolutely incredible sorry if the camera works really awkward in this video it's like in the style of vlog but um yeah really cool shit there he is again really happy with this man really happy so now i'm not exactly sure uh, what to do honestly like hmm, i don't know we'll figure something out um i mean i guess we can just go home and call it a day but i kind of don't want to let's see what else is around here i want to figure that out before we uh, go home and whatnot, and uh, I even brought an extra battery just in case this one dies. So let's see if there's like any malls or anything around here, dude. That'd be lit. <laughs> Ultimate DS man goes into a hot topic and takes a piss. <laughs> okay, so let's go to mall. Now, me carrying around a camera in a mall won't be too weird, I don't think. Oh shit, there's like one super close. It's like three minutes away. Oh my god, let's go. Yo, look at that. Hang on. Three minutes away. Let's go. Let's go to this mall. Alright, see you guys then. Alright guys, we are here at the mall. And this is what it looks like. It's also Books A Million right there, which is really cool. 
And uh, yeah, let's go ahead and go inside, I guess. Be an epic YouTube man. I've never even been in this mall before, so I don't even know what the hell is in here. It's so hot outside, it's ridiculous. Well, hope you guys enjoyed this video, though. Where the frick am I, dude? I don't even know. I've never been here before. Here we are. Try not to get the police car because I don't want to bother him. So, ooh, look at that. People are gonna think I'm a dumb tourist or something. There it is. Really cool shit. I've never been here before, so this is gonna be something. I don't even know what's in here. Ooh. Oh wow, this is so cool. Hmm. Look at that. There's a fountain in the middle. Try not recording anyone's faces or make an attempt not. At That's so cool. I don't know what's that. Yeah. That's a felt it's a JC Penny over there. It's actually finger this way. I don't think there's anything over there. Some of these are closed down. Look at that. Scary. Spooky. Yeah, like rubber chickens. I haven't shown much of them all yet, but here's what it looks like. It's very pretty. My camera's gonna die. Now that's what I call epic. Oh, Kiki's delivery service. It's Kiki. It's the cat from Kiki's delivery service. That's cool. We got the weeaboo section. Oh man, it's Miku. This is thick, holy crap. All of it just fell. How much is this? This is twenty dollars. Oh my god, all of it's falling. They have good night one one. Holy shit. This is my favorite manga. This is amazing. Everyone go read it. It's amazing. I'm gonna try to put this back up here. Okay. Here's the weeboo section. There's Jojo. We got Devil Man. All kinds of stuff. Dragon Ball. Ballerino. I can't believe they have Goodnight Pump Pump. That's awesome. I have the first three volumes. There's Dragon Maid. I have volume one and two of this series. That's daily. That's uh, Conan's daily life though. I got some more right there. Oh, I have this. A uh, fan of mine years ago gave me this actually, which is amazing. I don't know if I'm capturing this well at all. Alright. Nothing too interesting. We saw a vector. That's it. What the fuck? Oh my god. <laughs> we got Zelda. Ooh, cool. Look at that. That's awesome. Oh, there it is again. Fallout 76. The best game ever made. Fortnite. What else they got? Not much. Oh my god, did I just... How to be an epic gamer. Oh, near Automata. That's pretty cool. Anything else interesting? Not really. Not to me at least. They got TED Talk? Oh my god. Anything over here? Nope. They still make those? I used to be a huge fan of Diary of a Wimpy Kid. Yeah, nothing too interesting. We tried. I might buy the Vector though. They got Kirby. Oh. It's got Kirby. I actually have this Kirby. Uh, nothing too interesting. Dragon Ball stuff. Alright. We can go ahead and bounce. That's what the mall looks like. I haven't shown it off yet. Well, I did, but 
yeah, this camera battery is getting really low. So I'm gonna have to stop it pretty soon. Just wanna show off a little bit more. It's really nice, this is kinda small. It doesn't really have much. All right guys, we are back home now and we have our hole right here. Uh, you may know something else uh, that's right here that you didn't see in the footage. And this is a toy, um, the toy Island Knuckles figure. And uh, I picked this guy up for only $10 and it was at a retro video game store. And uh, they, had, um, they had a really big uh, resource Sonic figure going for $40, which I want to get in the future if I ever go back there. Um, that was really cool. And he had a Kelly Toy Mario plush as well, which was really cool. And he had all kinds of other action figures and stuff, and comics, and it was a really cool store. Uh, I might put up some pictures I took on my phone. I would have recorded it, but my camera died. Um, and the second battery I brought, um, it's dead too, apparently. Um, I, I thought I charged it, but apparently I didn't. Um, so yeah, that's why it wasn't recorded. But yeah, I got a uh, Toy Island Knuckles figure for only $10. Let's do a little close-up on him. There he is, his Toy Island Knuckles. It's really cool. I've always wanted this Knuckles figure, and it's really cool to have him. I used to own a really big, uh, I think it was a 10-inch, uh, Toy Island Sonic figure. And I also owned a smaller uh, Toy Island Tails figure. You know, the one that had the spinning tails and looked really stupid. But I have the Toy Island Knuckles now. And this is really cool. I really like this Knuckles figure. And we also have... I already opened it. But we also have the Snake Amiibo. He looks really cool. It's not Sonic related, but hey. Might as well show it off, because it's Snake. Colonel! Colonel Hamburger! Hamburger! Colonel! But yeah. Colonel, I'm plastic! So we'll put him, uh, we'll put him like... Yeah. Put toy uh, knuckles over here. There we go. And now we're going to be unboxing these guys right here. So let's start off with Sonic first. Uh, you guys have already seen the packaging. I really like the packaging, so I'm going to try to be as careful as possible <laughs> while opening this. So what I tend to do is cut the plastic like so, <laughs> and I don't cut the actual. Oh goodness cardboard so it doesn't ah, damage it so it opens like that pretty much so we're gonna cut the rest away down uh, try the other side this is what I usually do when opening stuff like this and I want to keep the box I kind of cut it a little bad but it's all right so we're gonna try to take him out Goodness, he's like really in there. There we go. Let's put that back in there. Back in there we go. And there we go. That is well. I kind of messed it back up. It's fine. But that's how you successfully uh, save a box, even though it's you know open and you can tell where it's cut. But still, I'm gonna keep the packaging. Though. So there we go. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look at Sonic. Oh my god, dude. He looks so cool. Alright, I don't know how I'm going to do this. Because it's a bendy figure. So, uh, I don't want to be too rough with it. Okay, there we go. Oh my goodness. So there's Sonic. Oh my god. He has neck articulation as well. Oh my goodness. Yo. And let's uh, get out Knuckles. The knuckles spinny thingy. I don't even know how this works. He's got a little platform. Don't know if you can see that. There it is. This looks like either the Sonic Battle or Sonic Advance Sprite. How do we work this? Oh! So there's a way to get out his... Oh, here we go. Oh, okay. Okay, I see you. So this is what it looks like. There we go. It's the same thing on the other side as well. And yeah. And we put them on this little platform right here. This is a very weird idea for like an accessory. But this is still pretty neat. I'm going to display him on my shelf. Sorry if you see my freaking horrible fingernails. I apologize. That is what we call anxiety. <laughs> 
so there we go. Uh, let's take a look at Sonic. This is really nice. Like, holy crap. I, I gotta show you guys. So look how nice he looks. The sculpt is amazing. And the paint is amazing too. He has neck articulation. But that's the only point. Uh, this is a bendy figure, just like the Sonic Adventure 2 figure. So you can bend him like this. Like that. And you can move his legs this and I really like uh, bendy figures in the fact that like you don't have to worry about uh, seeing joints on the figure so it looks more game accurate so this Sonic is like the most game accurate Sonic we've ever gotten or like gotten in a long time like this is so good like I've already really liked the uh, Tomy figure let me go get it real quick so this is Tomy's modern Sonic versus uh, Jack Pacific's and it's really, really nice. Uh, Tomy's is a lot smaller, but I really like the Tomy Modern Sonic figure, but this, this, <laughs> this takes a cake for me. I'm sorry, Tomy, I love you. I'll miss you. But like, dude, this, like, this is, this is good. I really like this Sonic. Let's try again to stand up. Let's see how easy it is. Oh, let's see, I'm gonna bend him a little bit. Oh, there we go. It'll take uh, some adjusting and whatnot, but yeah. This Sonic is really nice. I would highly, highly recommend him. He's extremely nice. Um, the only problem I seem to have is that his neck does like... I'll show you guys. If you move his neck like that, it does seem kind of like loose or wobbly. But like it is a bendy figure, so... Yeah to be careful though I don't want to break them or anything but yeah this song is really cool now let's go ahead and unbox and take a look at tails try to have Sonic stand up right here there we go all right let's go ahead and open up tails That should be good. So now, let us take out tail. There we go. All right, so let's get out tails here. We have the Amy spinner thingy. Uh, we don't have an Amy figure for this line, unfortunately, but we have that at least. So if they ever, uh, if they make like another line or wave two, then maybe they can add Amy. And maybe like Eggman or something. Okay. Oh, there we go. That wasn't that bad. This Tails, oh my god. This Tails, dude. Let's do a little close up right here. This is Tails. And he is really nice. Like the sculpt, the paint, everything is on point. You can move his Tails. You can move everything pretty much. This, this. You can move like anything, man. Because it is a bendy figure. His legs. Really awesome. His neck. God, this looks so good. Let's, let's grab the horrible, horrible, horrible Tomy Modern Tales. Look at this. This? What the fuck? Like, this is a terrible figure. Like, what the fuck is wrong with his legs? This is so much better. This is like, holy crap, you can never go back, man. This is really nice. Like, I have no complaints at all. It's just perfect. Literally perfect. That is, that is a great Tails. This Tommy one sucks. Alright, let's go ahead and try to work this out. Oh, there we go. Alright, I guess that's it. And then we're going to put it on here. Alright, we got the uh, Amy Spinner thingamajig. This is what it looks like. And I believe this sprite is also from either Sonic Advance or Sonic Battle. One of those games. It's definitely one of the GBA games. But yeah, that was my, uh, you know, uh, Sonic merch hunting video and unboxing. And I hope you all enjoyed it and uh, all that shit. So, hope you all enjoyed it. Uh, if you have these figures, 
uh, let me know what you think of them. Because I think they're fantastic. I'm going to try to get Tails to stand up. Because his tails might interfere with that. So let's see if I can do it. Oh, almost. Yeah, he's going to be really top heavy. <laughs> Damn it. So, uh, if you enjoyed this video and uh, the style of this video as well, let me know uh, your thoughts on these figures, the haul and the video and my content in general. Uh, all feedback is appreciated on this channel. Um, me and notice the desk is really, it's different because I rearranged my room completely. So, yeah. Um, even though I might get a new room in like a month from now because apparently uh, I might be moving. So, what? Yeah, um, but this, this, this Sonic, like, it literally, like, this might be one of my favorite Sonic figures I have now, like, this thing is, it's so good. Like, it's so game accurate, too. Like, this is the most game accurate Sonic figure I think we've ever just gotten in general, man. Like, this thing is great. Like, I know some people don't like bendy figures, which is understandable, but, like, I would highly recommend this figure. It is so good. Um, if you could find it, um, these can be found at Target, uh, ever since Toys R Us, you know, went out of business and whatnot, uh, went bankrupt, um, Target has been the go-to place for, uh, Sonic stuff, so if you're a diehard Sonic fan, and you even make your own merch hunt videos, Target is the place to go, my friend. Um, I imagine Hot Topic and maybe Spencer's at a mall might have some stuff, but... You know, Target is a good place to get some Sonic stuff. Um, even if you have to dig, like I had to go into the uh, normal to uh, toys aisle instead of the whole gaming aisles that have plushies and whatnot. Um, these were in the toy uh, the toys aisle instead of the gaming section. So, yeah, and this toy out of Knuckles is really cool. I've always wanted this figure. And uh, yeah, so let me know if you guys enjoyed this video and the style of this video. And whatnot. Just leave me all your feedback and whatnot. It's all appreciated. And uh, let me know what you think of these figures. I think they're really damn cool. I really like them. And uh, yeah, I would highly recommend them. So uh, I guess this all's with Yes Men. Uh, signing off. Thanks for watching.